Hey guys, this is D from Curvy DQ here, and I said that really fast because I'm actually pretty excited about this, like I was the new Kirby game. Now, this is GameSpot. This is one of my sites that I like to go on to just look up stuff about games, mostly IGN and GameStop. Sorry. It's GameSpot. Sorry. Um, I really like this site anyway. I, Sorry, I, that was kind of just a prank. It's just a prank pro. Um, but this is really exciting. Now, don't, I would advise, don't, um, look at this. Yeah, you've already looked at the heading. But, um, I'm just gonna show you this little clip. I can't play all of it because that's against YouTube's terms and conditions. And I did that in a video, and now Nintendo steals all my monies. Microsoft announced it will support cross-platform play between Xbox One, Windows 10, and, quote, other online multiplayer networks. It'll be up to the teams at places like Steam and PlayStation if they want to support this, but Microsoft has left an open invitation. Rocket League will be the first game to let Xbox One users play with others on Windows 10, the same way that Rocket League on PS4 can match up with players on PC. Seems like a pretty big deal. Now, um, I'm really excited for this. So basically what this is, is some sort of unified Steam, uh, um, XBLA, P and PSN fusion like um live um X station live network steam at X steam Shin live network play 10 yeah that that's the that's the perfect name right there i just thought of the name illuminati confirmed there's the right that's the name right there so my friend told me this um he actually has a channel CMR does. I'll link him down in the description as well as an annotation in the video. He's a pretty awesome channel with just reactions and stuff. Sorry, class promo. But um, I'm I don't um play Rocket League. I've heard it's a pretty cool game. Like how that's really the coolest game ever. Who who th ever thought of that? You're a genius, and you should you should be earning millions. You should be like Bill Gates. That's the most creative idea ever. I'm I'm serious. That sounds really fun. But. I do kind of want to get Rocket League, and um, my main concern about the um, for this is um, PC players will have an advantage because um, yeah, some people, some console players are going to be like, "Why I'm so much better than those like PCs?" Like I know, um, just um, you can shut up your biased mouth, console peasant. Yes, that was a joke. I actually like consoles and PC. I like PC a little bit better, it just fits my style. But um you're not console peasants, I obviously respect consoles console playing people. Um my main concern is now I'm imagining all the big games like um COD Battlefield, um any other indie game like multiplayer indie game like hashtag IDARB and Rocket League like an indie game. Minecraft will probably do this on all of them, that would be pretty easy. My main concern is, like I said, the controls are different on the PC than they are on the console, and that's just a fact. And because of that fact, a mouse, it's not like, um, if, it's not a, um, a reflex thing. It's not like, um, a console, it's not like, but the thing is, a mouse can spin physically faster than a joy, um, an analog stick. Now, I know... You, um, console guys and gals are gonna be like, no, that's no, no way. But it is a scientific fact, okay? I, I just wanted to get that out. It, it kind of, uh, yeah, my friend, CMR does said he, it didn't even matter to him because he's just gonna wreck all the scrubs with his MLG skills as he's already, um, used to playing on the Xbox One. But that's really my main concern. I'm guessing that they'll have separate servers. There'll probably be one server, if you're on PC, there'll be one server for just PCs only, and then there'll be another server for all, all the consoles. And if you're on a console, there'll probably be, um, a server for just your console, then there'll be a server for both consoles, and then there'll be a server for both consoles and PC. So you can, if you, if you want to be with all the, um, the PC master race or, or your feather, your fellow console peasants. Yeah, that was another joke. Um, and you guys may know, but, um, Sony is not really the most, 
uh, how do I say this, agreeable when you ask them about stuff like this. Usually Sony, um, Sony, um, doesn't really like getting into other companies' ideas. They just pay other companies big money to get the DLCs first. Like, they didn't, like, Destiny, you get free stuff on Destiny when you first get it on PS4. You, um, Awakening came out one month before it did on XB1. Um, but Sony's not exactly known for being open. But Sony did kind of respond to this because this whole thing has been organized by Window, uh, by, um, Microsoft. So, Sony responded, this is another, like I said, GameSpot article. On Monday, Microsoft publicly invited other platform holders to allow the same games to be played online across different console networks. Since an un such an unprecedented move, if enacted, could bring an end to more of a decade of segregation between the PlayStation Network and Xbox Live. Now that sounds like a thing that um, Martin Luther King would say. I know, that was... N no, I shouldn't have said that. Um... Sony's response, issued one day later to GameSpot, suggests that the marketing le market leading platform holder remains open minded about cross console play but stops short of discussing a deal with Xbox Live. PlayStation has been supporting cross platform play between PC on several software titles, starting with Final Fantasy XI on PS2 and PC back in 2002, reads the statement from the corporation. We would be happy to have the conversation with any pub publishers or developers who are interested in cross platform play. Sony's response, which is, Sony's response was a direct question about whether it would be interested in working with Microsoft. It is unclear how to read into Sony's decision to avoid mentioning other console platform holders in its statement, whether that means it is still evaluating its options or is outright against such plans. GameSpot has contacted the corporation for further, ca further clarification. On Monday, Microsoft made the eye-catching announcement that'll that it will support cross-platform play between Xbox One, Windows 10, and other multiplayer networks. That doesn't necessarily mean they were talking about PS4, but let's just say um, I was Sonic. I wouldn't talk about Mario, like, exclusively, unless you're, like, iDubs and Jinx, because they really hate each other. Um, you know what? Sonic probably would mention Mario, like, uh, hashtag RIP Mario. When Nintendo goes out of, inevitably out of business. Um, yeah, I shouldn't have made that analogy. I just made a bunch of people angry. But, um, such a feature is already present in the PS4 version, which allowed PSN players to set up matches with players on Steam, on Rocket League. Yeah, like I said, I'm interested in Rocket League. Um, thing about Rocket League is, it is, um, just a basic racing game. If you have, um, a, a mouse, it's not really gonna affect your um, ability anymore to play Rocket League. Yeah, I, I know. It just won't. Sorry, sorry, PC Master Race peoples. Um, but I guess, thank you for watching this video. I'm really excited for this because, um, most of my friends, like Speedy Rob 66 CMR does, um, and a lot of other peeps have other systems, and no one can really play PC games with me because they don't, they A, don't have enough money, or B, don't have a gaming PC that can handle games like COD. So I would be thrilled to see this. Like, I could all play together with my friends on um, P um PSN and Xbox Live and Steam. That would just be amazing for me. If they will re release CSGO, that would be my... I would... I would really... I'd really love that, actually. Um, so let's just... Let's just hope that, um... Sony responds, and maybe the console wars could stop. Thank you for watching.